Hello again. So, uh, I've mentioned in the past that I own a game store, and I figured since I'm not painting today and I'm at the game store, I might show you around and uh, give you a look at the store since there's nobody here at the moment, and uh, I would definitely feel self-conscious if I was standing here talking to this camera uh, with customers in the store. So since it's a little quiet, I will just give you a little peek around the store and show you what things are like here um, when there's no people. All uh, right, so hold on. Here we go. So this is the front counter. This is, uh, this is where all the action happens. This is, uh, you know, bringing up products and such. Happens right here. But behind the counter, we've got a fine selection of magic products. Uh, we actually get a large community of people in who play magic. Look at all the binders for singles. Uh, and so anyway, like today's Friday, so Friday night in a little while we're going to be stuffed full of gamers playing magic. Alright, what's next? Role playing. You can't have a game store without a selection of role playing items. Look at all the Dungeons and Dragons. But that's not all. And over here we've got the Warhammer wall. Let's just take a walk down Warhammer Lane. We kind of do have the uh, largest selection of Warhammer items in our region, both Fantasy and 40k. But we also carry uh, War Machine and Hordes, and Infinity, Lord of the Rings, Malifaux, what else do we have? Oh, there's, there's our horde stuff. Some of it, anyway. Books. More minis. More minis. More minis. More minis. Guess what? If you're a miniature player, you probably want to come here. Yeah, lots of war machine and hordes. But what else? How about board games? those. Just a few, you know. Handful, really. You know, just a couple. Both new and used. We have a used board game selection over here. Oh wait, there's some more stuff. Some of the demo games. Puzzles. Board games, some classic stuff, you know, chess, backgammon, old school risk, party game section. It's actually been really popular. Oh, look, Hero Clicks. Travel games, darts. We actually have a great selection of darts. Uh, unlike, well, pretty much any other store in this area. Painted miniatures from us and some of our customers. That one you might recognize. Settlers of Catan shelf, Carcassonne shelf. There's so many products for those lines that you know you gotta have their their own section. Look, yo-yos. The living card games from Fantasy Flight Games and their many expansions. Back to the uh, collectible card games. While this is actually all the uh, accessories for those games. Some Pokemon. 
Hey, and can you guess what our best-selling game of all time here is? Bananagrams. No, I'm serious. Bananagrams. <laughs> we sell tons of these things. It's a great game. Of course, dice. Some smaller games, card games. This isn't even everything. I mean, I don't know if you're getting a full, full feel for everything that we have here. And we have gaming tables in the back. And our used role playing section. Look at this table. This is our, uh, it's a little shiny right now, but this is our uh, city table with no terrain on it. It's, it's a work of art. My partner Seth, when he puts his mind to it, you know, he turns these tables into something kind of amazing. It still needs a uh, matte coat though, so which is why you're seeing the lights glaring down from above. But, you know, we've got a bit of space back here. But that's it. I just wanted to show you around. Uh, since I can't be painting today and I can't be shooting, uh, miniature painting videos, I figured I'd show you the other thing that I do, and that's uh, Greenfield Games in Greenfield, Massachusetts, right downtown. I'll talk to you later.